Hi guys, Chris here with the uh, Zeus Transformer Book T100HA. I'm just going to do a very quick demonstration here of the kind of level of multitasking you can do on this tablet here with the Cherry Trail X5Z8500 and 4GB of RAM. Now my, my version also has a 64GB EMMC drive, but that's not going to really make a difference. So I'm, I'm running here the news application. Uh, and you can see that it's scrolling quite fluid, but at the same time I also have a lot of things open here. I've got... Uh, Chrome's open. Scrolling in Chrome's a little bit slow there, but it's not too bad. It has improved now with the recent updates in Chrome. And also got various tabs open here within Microsoft Edge. You can see that, um, yeah, I've got a number of tabs open there. I am one of those people that do like to browse with various tabs open to switch back and forth between them. And you can see that it's quite fast. Now I'm going to really push the system here to the limit. I'm going to run a 4K video here, stream that from YouTube, just any old UK uh, 4K sample there. So just jump in, test that out and see what kind of impact that has. Now streaming 4K from Chrome and it's not gonna work too well because it's, it's extremely slow so I wouldn't recommend doing that. And of course the display here doesn't support 4K video. This is only an, uh, a 1280 by 800 resolution screen, but you can output 4K to a monitor limited to 30 hertz there. So if I just put on the, is that a 4K tray? I don't think it is. There we go, that one is. And have a look now at what the CPU is also doing trying to play this. So at, okay, it says there's a little bit of lag there. And probably my net, actually it's on my network connection. You can see that now it's dropped down to 1440p, but I want to force it onto 4K. And it's just caching that up now. There we go. So I'm just going to pause that to let it cache a little bit. I don't quite think my internet connection can keep up with that. So we go run it now. Okay, so that's running just fine. If I go back now and have a look at the CPU, it's running around 80% maximum there. So that video is, is definitely taxing it somewhat. Now I've just taken a screen grab, go back into paint here that I have running, paste that. Of course, Paint's not a demanding uh, application at all there. It's not like Photoshop. You just go along and just crop a part of this, crop that, uh, GC Marina, move that over, run. Actually, let's just do multi-window test here. So run side by side and select, where is it? Store, okay, jump to the store there. And that's uh, fast enough. How's that work with my finger there? It's still scrolling okay there. And then it's keeping up. This is not too bad considering this is just a little Atom chip here. Definitely much better than the older Atoms that used to just, this would completely bog down with them. Now, uh, RAM usage, you're probably thinking how much RAM am I using now? Uh, almost full there. So running all those tabs I have there in Edge. How many I'm running there? Okay, two, four, six, seven tabs there. And running another four in Chrome. Chrome, of course, is a lot more heavy on the memory there, so it'll be sucking up quite a bit of memory. And it's doing okay there. I think not a bad job at all. Move that over, paint, multi screen there, select, task manager, have a look at eye there on the CPU. It's doing okay, I think, for what it is. So there's a, a demo there of multitasking on the T100HA. That's the Transformer book, of course. Thank you for watching. I'll have more up and coming videos with gaming as well, so do keep an eye out for those. Bye for now.